Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you. And part of the story here is the Albight Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to bringing you this World Cup round of 16 match. It's Brazil versus the Korea Republic. Absolutely, this should be a good game. I think both sides deserve to be here. But whichever team plays to their full potential should make it into the quarterfinals. It's going to be a good game. And so the match is underway. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Alexandro plays with Danilo in the fullback positions. Casemiro plays alongside Lucas Paqueta in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Neymar. He has time to play it over. Not high quality defending. Well, Brazil are the best World Cup team in history. Oh, he could be in here, Derek. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Casemiro. Danilo. Paqueta. Fred. Big chance to get them on turns. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Jung. And he has options available. And given away. And the emphasis is on creativity, but nothing comes of it. Paqueta. And slipped through beautifully. Well, borderline offside, but correct. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Neymar. Here's Marquinhos. Casemiro. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Good bit of pressing. Danilo. That's a useful cross. Well, they can keep possession of it now. And showing fine vision. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Paqueta. Neymar. The verdict is offside here. not sufficiently well played in and there it is the half-time whistle second half is underway Brazil behind can they turn this match on its head Paqueta. 
Now with Neymar. Back to Paqueta. Not to be this time. Huang Ui Jo. Now Song. Well, there it is. Brazil have controlled the possession, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker, play forward earlier and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. Neymar. Neymar! Well, the keeper had a lot to do. Well, it's a great piece of goalkeeping. So quick off his line. Well, he's given it away. Encouraging move this from Brazil. Neymar. Kim. Huang In Biom. Huang Ui Jo. And can they exploit the space out wide? And let's give credit to the defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And he's through here. But if you make your move too early, you're always in danger of being ruled offside. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Paqueta. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And a good-looking ball. And Neymar's lost the defenders. Oh, a goal! An equaliser in the closing stages. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Chance to run at them. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Paqueta must take the lead here, and they do, and with so little time left, that will surely be decisive, astonishing drama. What a big moment in the dying embers, will it prove decisive here? Lee Jae Sung, Song Joon Ho. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And there's the referee's whistle. 